guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl i did doing i did call for those that are just joining us but if you're a returning subscriber thank you for coming back it's your girl you know how we do it now you guys are the real mpvs so today i'll be taking you all on a trip to malta it's a group trip so enjoy sit back grab it popcorn let's go hi guys Can you say hello say hello Family. <laughs> Hi. 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 We're about to go to Malta. We still have two people coming, so this is the group. No, 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 So this is everybody ready for checking my husband, Genevieve and Adams, Bukola and T. So we have checked in and we're going to the flight now. We're going to our flight. That's everybody at the back as well. They took some of our items down because they were more than 100 ml. We're almost late for our flight. <laughs> oh, T. <laughs> Shoes. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> at last <laughs> nobody missed their flight thank god so we've bought it now so guys we have bought it now oh. the rest of the crew of course we were scattered <laughs> so there's someone in the back you see us when we look highlight again till then hi say bye to my people so we have landed at Malta International Airport and they used a bus to carry us from the flight area or you know from the disembarkment area if there's anything like that to this side to the non Schengen areas I forgot to record a you know check-in process but this is how the airport looks like on the inside it's quite beautiful Uber doesn't work here so we ordered for both and took the van option so this is the van that will be taking us to our hotel yeah hello hi are you tired Bye. how was your trip Double legs. <laughs> Hi, uh. Oh my goodness. Such oh. a long flight. How was your trip? Oh, it was not. I know, right? <laughs> Guys, look oh, back. Not, you push, look Hello. back. How was your trip? <laughs> I know. <laughs> it wasn't one of the best trips. Okay, see you at the hotel. On our way to the hotel now, and this is what the streets of Malta looks like it's quite peaceful and serene very nice and beautiful so this is our hotel maritime antonine hotel and spa and this is what it looks like from the outside and we're going inside now to check in uh unfortunately for us the check-in time was three o'clock but we thought we were going to be able to schedule them to allow us have an early check-in but that was not the case so we just had to drop our bags submit our details and we were asked to come back at three o'clock for the keys however we could use all the other parts of the hotel if we wanted so we decided to go eat because we were hungry so we made our orders and we are waiting this is bukola hi this is t <laughs> hello t and this is myself and this is my husband that's why we content creator. What's that? <laughs> 
okay so we have gotten our keys this is our room on the fifth floor this is the bedroom it's quite big and spacious and roomy i usually like my room to be very spacious and all and i'm trying to get the views oh see the views the views are nice and the room all this across me as well their hotel this is how their buildings are like here so that's the big views and this is the bathroom that's the bathtub mirror and there's me again <laughs> Do you know what time it is? It's massage time. Okay. Hello, Mama. Come on. So after we left the spa place, we decided to check out the rest of the hotel. We saw these beautiful walkways, we took some pictures and videos, and then we decided to change for the night so that we could find some food. So we just all took a stroll outside, and this is what Malta looks like at night. It's very beautiful. <laughs> and I noticed that all of their houses have the same color. It's all painted in is it beige now or cream all their houses are exactly that color so we found this food house it's called steak house potter's house steak house grill and we went inside this which is this and 500 grams of this which is this this one is one kilo Okay, it's fine for. But we're talking about four six. This one is not worth it. Chateaubriand. Chateaubriand is here. Okay, okay. I think I can have this. I can have this one, but this one I don't know. Chateaubriand, it's very, it's very good. It's very good. Yes, one of that's very good one. Okay. But let's see what they are having for six, sir. Okay. Okay. But I suggested this one for six. Okay. Yes, the ladies. So they gave us some bread, <laughs> or is it buns bread now, to start with, and we devoured it. Our food came right on time, and you can bet that it was as good as it tastes. I forgot to record when we finished and demolished all the bones, but it was really yummy. We enjoyed it. So after, we decided to have games night. <laughs> Let me find number four. Finish it, finish it. Go, go, please finish it. Thank you. Oh yeah, Oh yeah, <laughs> so this is the second day and our hotel was um breakfast inclusive so this is where we'll be having our breakfast for the next couple of days and guys can you see how beautiful it looks it is isn't it 
so we had different varieties to choose from we were spoiled for choice her table always looked as if we were having a feast because we literally ha usually have a plate of everything that is on the menu we literally feasted on that table as you can see guys we have a piece of everything bacon omelets scrambled yogurt fruits baked beans croissants toast um let's talk about everything oh my god take me back take me back guys so yeah this is everybody having breakfast Okay, can you do a 360 for me? Woo! Woo! <laughs> so to get to Gozo Island, we had to take this bus which was going to take us to the ferry and then we'll catch another bus, the Gozo sightseeing bus which would take us around the town to all the historic and iconic places. So whilst we were in the bus, there were some beautiful scenes that i couldn't just let them go as you can see yeah and this is the group <laughs> we're always we're always let's <laughs> We made it to the ferry guys <laughs> and thank god for us immediately we entered the ferry was short we could have missed it if we were late by a second can you just imagine the beauty oh my god god is very powerful yeah and that kind of ferry that's also the same thing that we are on on this side that we are at yeah We had Gozo already and we'll be following the red Gozo sightseeing bus store to tour the city. That's our bus over there. So we're going towards the bus to board it and prepare for our journey. <laughs> it's a whole day trip, so we are ready. This is me trying to call the crew to enter the video, but they were too slow, so au revoir. And this is what Gozo Highland looks like. Can you see what I mean when I said that their houses are usually built with the color cream? I think it's part of their development plan. So the houses, everything is in this color, beige, cream, sandy color. So it makes it have like a deserty look, like a sandy look. See, all the houses are that color. If it's another country now, some people will say no, they want to paint their own green or red but the reverse is the case here is uniformed see everywhere is the same sandy color sandy color sandy color which is nice i mean they they've used that to preserve their culture over the years and have made it a tourist attraction for everyone so yeah still more sights and views from gozo beautiful houses with the same color again as well fun fact Malta's population is not up to 600,000. I think it's about 550. And that of Gozo Highland and Malta is, and um, Valletta is about 400,000. 
yeah so yes 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 see the houses same unique colors that they have afterwards we went to the shrine of the blessed virgin mary tapino it's in gozo malta and this is what it looks like on the outside and on the inside is as beautiful as it is on the outside you can see how beautiful it is it's huge and people were actually coming in to pray so i guess it's a praying ground so people were praying and we could you know feel a presence in there but <laughs> we don't know which presence it was because we were seeing um sculptures as well as cross so it was passing mixed signals across to be honest but that's besides the point it's really beautiful we took pictures even though I'm, i don't think we were supposed to take pictures because we had people looking at us as we were taking these pictures but we didn't know not until we were done and we saw the signs that uh, one of us saw the signs that we were not meant to take pictures so yeah again we were almost late to <laughs> We were almost late for our bus, as usual. And then later dinner. we had some dinner. Dinner. <laughs> <laughs> it's not nice. This is what they used to do. Get out. Oh, thank you. Happy so birthday much. to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Doi. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. So after the birthday wishes and breakfast, we decided to go to Valletta, the city of Valletta. So look at Valletta beautiful scene reviews see plenty plenty they have lots of islands and water in that place and museum that's like their major characteristics and plenty boats <laughs> can you see the views oh my goodness yeah and this is valletta so guys this is valletta and we took a walk around the city of valletta bought some souvenirs to take back with us to the house took loads and loads of pictures and yeah because you know why go to malta if we're not going to visit the famous valletta so yeah we had to visit it and it was worth it actually it was really you know pleasant to the eye um we saw some horses who wanted to take us on the trip but because we already had see that's the horses there so because we already had our up on up off bus stall ticket so we felt it was going to be a waste of money so we didn't take it so we took the bus instead um so we had like a 45 minutes window to tour the city and then come back for our pickup so i felt this thing looks very <laughs> scary to be honest but we still took pictures there but it was a bit scary when well, it was looking like three you know devils holding a plate yeah
<laughs> Tourist behavior. <laughs> Adam the diver. Gege, 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 look at our birthday girl. Ma, you want to be with a big boss? You want to rock kitty kitty? You want to rock kitty kitty? You want to rock with the big boy? Happy birthday, Tony! <laughs> Please, oh, don't fight us. Oh, your, your, your brother has left this place while he said he's not singing you on to Papa. <laughs> happy birthday. We wish you a happy, happy birthday. Uh, we pray that God blesses you, keeps you and your husband in Jesus' name. We're so proud of you. We, we, we love how energetic and how forward looking you are god bless you and increase you on all sides have a happy happy birthday babes you can come in and say happy birthday now <laughs> doing happy birthday proud to be your brother uh keep uh conquering your world keep winning and i pray that the lord uh, will take you to greater new heights amen all the way in the name of jesus amen may you continue to be a voice in your generation <laughs> have a fabulous year from Happy their data. Birthday. Happy birthday, darling. We mm -hmm. love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Happy Next location. <laughs> On to the next. <laughs> On to the next. <laughs>